here or what? Hey there. Mr. Geddes, this is the new ranch hand I told you about. Well, I heard you had some trouble with your welcome, but you kept your nerve and protected my property. No, it was nothing, sir. I'm David Geddes. Pleased to meet you. John, Jim, <laughs> Milton. Thank you for the opportunity, sir. You and Mr. Dickens. Well, you work hard. You be honest, you'll get your keep. I promise you that. Boy has a family. Oh, lucky man. Then you better work extra hard. Good day, Howdy, sir. gentlemen. Sir. You hear that, John, Jim? Extra hard. Hey, hey, get over here. Mr. Dickens, go find old Jim Milton here something to do. Make sure he works extra hard. Sure, Mr. Dickens. Come on this way. Under what I work will he do? Anyhow. Say, is that your family getting in? The wagon up there? Ah, I believe it is. Mind if we go welcome them? Not at all. Hey, is it true what they said about you when you arrived? I that you ran off those hired guns? Look, can we, uh, not discuss this in front of my wife? Oh, uh, no, sure. Yeah, of course, mister. I don't want to worry her. Oh, yeah. I hear that. Mrs. Milton! Jim Milton, how fine you seem. This kind man just collected us. Thank you, sir. I think we can be okay here. It's ranching work. This place is kinda... It's fine. But I hear you began your career in ranching by throwing your weight around. Real wise, <laughs> Jim. What was I supposed to do? The place was getting robbed. So you show everyone who's boss? Real fine. I didn't have much of a choice. I gotta go. Jack, when you're done in here, come on out and lend a hand. I was going to milk the cows. Come on, I'll do it. You hey. are gonna milk the cows? Sure. <laughs> Why not? Oh, uh, I don't know. I, I thought you was, uh... I'm a ranch hand. A new one, at that. When you got here, them hired guns? I was just getting my wagon back. That's all. Weren't nothing. Oh, it weren't nothing. It's about time someone stood up to them fellers. So, where are you from anyway, partner? Well, you know, up north, mostly. Been in these parts before, but that was years ago. Oh, it's changed. The rich fellas are coming in and buying everything, the ranches. But, well, it ain't as wild as it once were, at least. There is that. Say, if it ain't too personal a question, are you a gunslinger, mister? <laughs> Good lord, no. Nothing like that. Now, just a ranch hand, then. Just a ranch hand. <laughs> Lilo. Failed at a bunch of things, like most men. <laughs> well, I feel a whole heap better having a ranch hand like you around. That is for sure. <laughs> Let's see how you feel once you see me work. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Here's the cows. Where's the cow? I don't see any cow. Ah, oh, there, there. Just one. John? Yeah, we used to have a bunch of women here did most of the milking. Most of them drifted off. Okay. You fine with milking? You know, I ain't really done much of it. Could never, never really get the hang of it. You serious, mister? Sure. 
It's Jim. Jim Milton. Hey, just sit down. I'll show you how. Approach her calm now. She don't take too kindly to surprises. It's easy, right? Almost got a pail full. and learn, partner. We all gotta earn our keep. That's enough, Jim. Come on. How about you and the boy, uh, help me clean out the stables? Sure. Come on, son. How old are you now, Lancelot? Twelve, sir. Ain't that great. Oh, he's twelve. <coughs> such a fine name. I like it. I got it. I got imaginative parents, sir. <laughs> During Arthur's well, days, Jack was just five years old. Work, but it's gotta be done. Mr. Dickens said... I know what he said. We'll do it. Won't we, boy? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you get them stalls cleaned out, and I'll see you later. Bye. Okay. Jack, let's just... Try and take some pride in this work, hard as it may be. Boy, bring that wheelbarrow over here and keep it close to me. Yes, sir. We're gonna clean poop. We're gonna clean some manure. You're a long way from Angelo Bronte's mansion now. Sorry, sir. Nothing. <laughs> Angelo Bronte. I think your mother's hiding somewhere, laughing at us. Ew. Wait guys, my dog's barking outside. One moment. Sorry about that, guys. My dog's bark is not normal, so I just rush over. We're almost done here. You finish things up. I'll go check on her. Okay. What's the mission again? Return the peach fork. Shit, pursuit of the better life you want. Same as I've been. No, won't do him no harm. I know. Guess maybe we can last here. Survive. Do a little better than survive for once. I'm tired of fleeing, John. So, well, you know. Me too.
honest work. <laughs> no more crime. I'll put some coffee on. Three dollars pay. <laughs> By the way, where am I? Ah, still in same map. Oh, not wanted in black water anymore. Just checking, guys. Sorry, we're not wanted in black water anymore. Oh, so I lost some landmarks that I got as Arthur. If you remember, guys, if you see some landmarks, Arthur will draw it on his notebook. So I saw, I lost some. Yeah, I lost some landmarks. Let's check first what will happen if we go back there as John. Now, where's my horse? I miss the white horse. Do we have a rope? We don't have a rope. And we don't even have a gun. Hey, this horse is faster than the white one. I like this horse better. Yeah, he's faster. How much money do we have? Fourteen dollars. Ah, no. I guess we'll do the main quest first. We need money, so we'll do the main quest first. We're back to zero, guys. Something like that. We're poor again. Arthur's time, we're rich. We're poor again here. Ah, oh, the black horse? No, bro. We can't acquire it. What's that? What does this? You want punishment. Ah, that's the cheat code I remember. But we're not gonna use cheat. That's boring. This is his default horse, bro. Rachel. But it's better because it's much better than the white horse Arthur has. It's faster, I mean. <laughs> Nothing more, right? We're back on looting face. We don't have only knife. What's that? Oh, a snake, I guess. Yeah. Shit, I've been poisoned. I forgot what's the cure. What's the cure for poison? Come on, Rachel. Just wanna... Yeah, Rachel's much faster. 
than my white horse during Arthur's time. Yeah, since I've been playing this, I know the speed. She's much faster than the white horse. But the downside, guys, the white horse has a lot of stamina. Rachel has few. Once I got the rope, I'll try checking if we could still get the white horse. I know where to find it. Uh, we just need some clothes and the rope. Rope is very important. Sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to foal, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Oh, that's Mr. Dickens, son. I thought that's Jack. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get off. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Well, since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. <laughs> so, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well, oh, when Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh. Uh. Okay, then. All right. You'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get two. Thanks, kid. We gotta run, guys. As John, all the stats are reset. I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Oh. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I What horse is this? Pretty big one. Relax. Hey. That's Jeremiah. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. He looks like a nice horse. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their own, didn't they, boy? <sighs> Calm down. <sighs> he likes you. Ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me. Behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. Who's a good boy? I'm gonna take him out first. Burn some of this heat off of him. Okay. I'll wait in the corral. Hey, boy. Do you still have to calm him? I'll take out. Okay. So we ride him. Deplete Jeremiah's stamina to calm him enough to ride for Duncan. Oh! Okay, okay, I get it. You're gonna run. You're gonna sprint, guys, one moment. Oh, I miss hunting. Suddenly I miss hunting. I miss Pearson's cooking. Yeah, boy. Yeah, Jeremiah. We just have to deplete the stamina, guys. Bear with me. Let it all out of you. Alright, good boy. You ain't gonna 
give us no trouble now. First Master Jeremiah. What the fuck? Senpai, Jeremiah. All right, he's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there. Go nice and slow. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. The heart's beating a little. <laughs> Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Pony. <laughs> yeah. You think my son could borrow him? Huh? Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? They say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, and he's got all these hired guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. You're fine because John's here. He's the protege of Arthur. Arthur teach him a lot. Chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you. You Mr. Milton? I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my Thank husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. This is the stall. So, you know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too much. My God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, ma'am. Ah, uh, I get it, I get it. It's coming out one way or another. Grab them again. This is hard. Didn't come. Come on. And pull. Ah, uh, this is hard. Hold them, Milton. <laughs> Not much longer. <laughs> okay, well, I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we, we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm I'm busy, uh, too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day, Mr. Milton. Do we go back to 
Ah, uh, Abigail, yeah. Hey, John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? Been kind of withdrawn. Quiet. You know. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. Round to the left. What do you see? Pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go ride? Aside from home. I don't know. But maybe that stream? Good idea. And you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. Cute. <laughs> Pony. Just act confident, okay? Uh huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick, and a... Does that make the horse sprint? See, you can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa. Even faster, come on. Faster? What's happening? So I have to control the speed. Okay, okay, I get it. All right, let's go again. Why don't we speed it up again? Okay, come on. We can go even quicker. If you say so, sir. Yeah. Ah, I think I get it, I get it. Let's bring up the pace again. All right. Yeah, just like fast walking. If we bump Jack, <laughs> let's bump him. Let's bump him. Uh, 
Is it here? Here we are. Yep. I know you fell, but you think you're ready for a little race? I'll be fine. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go! Uh, maybe just a fatherly thing. I'll let him win, guys. I'll let him win. Uh, just to share, guys. I can win, see? <laughs> I can win. But fatherly thing. I'll just let him win. It's like fatherly love. <laughs> we'll let him win. We'll let him win. Well, it'll take long if I wait for you, so I'll sprint and I'll let you in there. Your horse is much bigger. And you're much smaller. Like a jockey. We'll let him win, guys. <laughs> this is just time consuming. Yeah, let him win. Let him win. Son. I beat you. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. <laughs> you need it. I saw a chicken. I think I want Tinola tomorrow. I'll get the coffee home. Oh, okay. Wait, guys, be back. I'll just bring my dog back inside. She's outside, sorry. One moment. Sorry about that, guys. Mokas outside. In trouble. Where are you working? I told you. Cleaning at the doctor's office. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Get the place to tidy. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. Next mission. Oh, Mr. Dickens. Hey, Milton. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. It's so free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. <sighs> but I will work hard, and I learn fast. Okay. Give me a hand with this fence. Yep. 
There's plenty more to do. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Okay. Again. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Now, lift up the other side. You gotta line up, see? Now the next rail. Good. Okay. Now I realize this is really a hard work, huh? You're doing all right. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton, Angus is no your need boss. For that. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on, move! <laughs> what a bull! Oh! I missed this! I missed the rope! Got a lot of damage. Where's the bull? Mr. Dickens? Oh, good. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. And you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. Boys, careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. Oh, 
Fancy pants get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. So he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, 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 come on, get him. Oh, kick his head in. Oh, 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 oh. oh, it's back. During when Arthur was sick, guys, it's hard to punch. I'll be honest. Strength is back. Of course, John's not sick. And a brawl. Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> what you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy. Tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. Stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. Nice punching. I miss the punching capabilities, guys. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any. I just want to hear the dialogue, guys. Wait, we'll approach the mission. I just want to hear the dialogue. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Oh, that's it? Okay. Mr. Geddes? Hey, I heard we had another incident with the uh, Laramie boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Yeah. I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Hmm. Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John <laughs> Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> I'm. I know what you mean by that. Pearson is cooking. All right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Hmm. What the hell was that? What are you, what are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Hey, we don't have a gun. Just saying. Crap. 
I suddenly missed the Lemoyne Riders, guys. They've killed Mr. Tobert, and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks he can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I sir. guess we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim. I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your, your, your name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We... I... What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. Wait, guys. What weapon is... Ah! What weapon is this? Repeater and shotgun. Nice! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, we only have regular bullets. I miss the express. I miss the express bullet. All right, let's go, guys. I miss guns, guys. I'll be honest. I miss guns. Where's the bat? Oh, there. There's no dialogue. All right, let's sprint. There's no dialogue. Let's sprint. Yeah, same, same, bro. Same. I miss the pirate hat. Is it here? Maybe. Ah, uh, no, it's not. Yeah, it's not here. Just the hat. Shotgun bullets are expensive. We don't have money here. <laughs> That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple guards out front. A couple more around the side, I imagine. Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah, there's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep, Tom. You head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn! I thought I'd come down here! You're all so tough! Ah, it's gone. And last one. Oh, I'll be honest, guys. John is better at dead eye. This is John's talent, let's be honest. This is John's talent. Wait guys, I'm thinking, sorry. Hmm.
Reload, guys, reload. There's another gun here. Shows in the map. Now, where's that gun? Map shows there's a gun. Who the heck's that gun? This is 1v1 guys This guy can fight! You know that woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's gotta make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes for. Where's Archer's hat? Can't lose it. We haven't unlocked the that option in the horse yet, where we can get the hat every time. I guess we have time. I'll just loot, guys. You know, we're poor here. <laughs> we're very poor. So every loot and every money matters. Bear with me, guys. It's looting time. Every money counts. Oh! I remember this gun! I remember this gun! It's my favorite! Come on, come on! Yeah, it's my favorite gun! If you remember, guys, the gun I used during Arthur's time, the one I called One Shot, One Kill, it's this gun. But I guess I can buy it. I need this one because we're poor right now, so bullet matters. This one has a lot of bullets. I have to conserve it, guys. I miss Arthur's money. Ah, uh, what I mean that by that guys is I have a lot of money during Arthur's time we need we need to loot guys we're poor Looting guys, sorry. <laughs> we're poor, we're poor. Hey, Rachel, wait a minute, okay? Rachel's the horse, guys, just saying. See? Look, Rachel. If you see the name. Lower right, Rachel. 
Be back, Rachel, okay? Just loot, because your mastery is poor. All loots matter. Why is John not picking up the cleaver? There! That's what I'm talking about. There's a lot of loot here, huh? Oh, jewelry and a coin first. You know, we can sell that, guys. We just need to find a fence later. Nice, nice. We're getting money. We're getting money. But that's not big enough. I think I need to find a gold bar. It's hard. It's hard to play poor mode, guys. Arthur's time, I can waste bullets and then just buy them again. This time, I have to really conserve them. It's cash. It's nice. It's cash. $50! That's big, guys. Arthur, Arthur's time, sometimes I ignore it. Premium cigarette is full. No more loots. I think there's loot upstairs. I'm not sure, guys. Just have to... Every loot counts, guys, you know. We can't miss. We're not rich right now. John's not a rich guy. I actually saw it on the Red Dead Redemption wiki. Playing as John, it's gonna be hard as poor to at least make, make it realistic. Because on the official story, guys, John is poor, actually. So, to make it realistic on the official story, they made it hard to gain cash during Jan. Just a few more bodies, guys. I think just five more.
Oh, I got an idea. What if... I was planning to deposit all my guns at my horse and then I'll pick up these other rifles. That way maybe we could get some free guns. No need to buy them. Because we need to conserve money as John. Come here, Rachel. You take the gun. I don't have guns, right? Yeah, take the pistols too. I don't need it for now. Oh. Okay. Guess I'll keep the pistols. Anyway. I'm just gonna loot the guns, guys. Yeah, I confirm. It's free gun. Sorry, guys. Bear with me, okay? Oh, it's upstairs. It's upstairs, right? Second floor, yeah. I remember this place. I remember this place. During Arthur's time, I had a raid here. This is the hideout of Odrisco's people. Stop swapping. Never mind, I guess. Leave that one. Maybe we could take a shortcut. Ah, yeah. Last gun, guys. Last gun. There. Now we're good. John dropped the guns. Really? Kidding me? Yeah, let's go back. I just wanna confirm guys, wait. Pump action, repeating, Springfield, Lich Repeater, Lancaster, Carbine. Yeah, we got the guns. Nice, nice. Alright, we can go back. Free guns. Nothing better than free guns. say nothing sir just doing my job now I don't think they'll be back tonight but how about Abe just in case you stay up yep you see anything or hear anything you fire that rifle three times three times we'll all come running we'll do 
Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. Uh, I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? What choice did I have? I agree with John. Answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Well, just me personally, I agree with John. They have to. He has to fight. He's sleeping there. He's sleeping there. Look, just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Arthur's voice. <laughs> Next mission. Oh, it's Abigail. How you getting on? Surviving. I think. Here. I'll get you some coffee. The only thing I know how to do is... You know, Undertaker's like me. Cattle. Not so much. That ain't true. Ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was... I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a... old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but... I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. Oh. We could be... Just to share, guys, uh, you see the reaction, guys, that Abigail was reading. Just to share, guys, Abigail is no read and write. Happy, John. Bank loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been has been the same. We start doing okay, and then boom. You act like the big man with the gun. Tired, John, and... I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. Mm. I'm doing better. Milton. Milton, ma'am. Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. It's getting soft. Lance a lot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name, and the other's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes. A real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. I'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. You save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on. Yeah. You take care now. Of course. There might be dialogue, so we'll go slowly. It's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in the house, Pa. I think just about doing things you like, boy. What happened the other night? With those men, did you kill them? I did what I had to do. To protect you. Ma said it was pride or something. Your Ma was wrong about that. No dialogue. Let's print. You know, guys, dialogue is where we get the story. Short to slow down. Tell him to go faster. 
give him a little switch, and then pull to one side if you want to turn. Here, try it out. Enough? For now. That game's strawberry, eh, hey, kid? Looks like. You know, I think this is the longest I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I'll leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. Very good. What the fuck? I have a feeling that Phil will prove more profitable than theater production from the new place. All right, here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. You wait here. I won't be long. Okay. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. Okay there. Need some? Gentlemen? Hi. Mister. Hey, mister. How are we getting ordered by greeting? I see. Still same with Arthur. Hi. I'm here. To... Name? My name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. Nope, nothing here. Uh, maybe try Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay, John Marston. Marston... Nope, nothing here for that name either. Try Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Ah, uh, it's, uh... Mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. Everything okay, Pop? Sure. I hope so, at least. Here. You if you remember, you guys, I think the other guy's a bounty hunter. Come on, son. You'll enjoy it if you try a little harder. Okay. Okay, Pa. Yep. We're going back to Pronghorn, okay? So, wait. We've come all the way out here and we just gonna turn around and go back? That's what we're doing. Turns out, uh, I missed the seclusion of the ranch more than I figured for. Don't you want to go to the store or the saloon or anywhere? We're going back. Okay, boy? But... I've been sitting in this wagon I don't know how long. But nothing. Keep on driving and watch the road. Yes, sir. Thank you. Jesus. Mind your father, okay? I got my reasons, even if I don't care to explain them. Yes, sir. Better. Ah, at least for once, I'm not driving. <laughs> Say slow down. You slow down, okay? Uh, sure. 
All right, speed up. Let's get away from there. Okay. Here. Should I speed up again? No, no, no. It's a turn. It's a turning point. Wait. It's gonna turn. And another turn. I can see. We'll speed up when it's a straight one. Sorry, sir. Was that a question for me? No. No. Keep driving. Faster, please. Just a bit faster now. Someone's following us. <laughs> I think we're going too fast, Pa. But pull your reins in. Slow it down. Don't want to seem like we're running away from anything. Uh, okay. Whoa. Well, I don't like driving across here. It's the same as any other road. Look where you want to go, and the horse will follow. Okay. I think the horse is getting skittish. That guy's following us, guys. If you can see, we don't have a gun. Huh? What? Nothing. Just keep driving. Yeah. Okay. What? What's wrong? Don't look around. Oh, Pod. Hey. Those men. Are they following us? Just, just stay calm. See that fallen tree? When we get there. Stop the wagon, jump down, and hide. Oh, Pa. You need to do exactly as I say, boy. Here, now! Uh, come on! Quick, down! Okay, son, you wait here. You don't move or say nothing until I speak to you. You hear? Yes, sir. Head down. Okay, gentlemen. Let's see what you come calling about. What do you boys want with us? Oh, we just want to have a friendly chat. Are you John Marshall? You sure look like him. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just here with my son. Did you kill a fella out in Roanoke a few months back? No. Wasn't me. That was my brother. Mm. I'm real sorry, friend, but he was trying to rob. Me. You're talking bullshit, Mister. Kill him. Ah! ah. One moment, guys. We're not rich, you know. <laughs> We're not rich. Will I drive? Come Let on. your son drive. Yeah. I don't want to drive. Oh dear, those men! I told you not to look, boy. Are they dead? I didn't have much of a choice. You saw that? Now, compose yourself. You killed them, Pop. Huh? Son, I need you to hold it together. Like I said. Really? Uh huh. If you hadn't listened, things could have gone real wrong for us.
I think there's no dialogue. I'll sprint up. shot at shot at what happened well we got followed and then we... followed by who probably someone who knew me if we didn't get to them particulars i'm sorry my son our son it was your dress that caused all the problems it weren't even a dress it was a gift for you I wonder what's that. I mean, if it's a gift for John, I wonder what's that. Hey, Mr. Jim? Mr. Jim? Hey! Uh, there's a telegram messenger for you over there in, near the house. There is? Okay. Thanks, Abe. What do you think he wants? I have no idea. But I doubt someone wants to give me a big pile of money. That's him. I see him. Thanks, Abe. Excuse me, mister. I'm Jim Milton. Heard you had a telegram for me? Yes, here. Sign there. Thank you. Huh? Jim, stop. If you're the JM I know, stop. It's Sadie Adler. I've got something to discuss. Pay good. Meet me in saloon in Valentine. I'm there most days. Stop. Sadie Adler. I'll be damned. Abigail. Not home. Darling John, a kind lady in the village helped me write this. She had men problems of her own, but that's a different story. Listen, I've begged you, but it don't seem to make much difference. I've tried everything I know to make you grow up. And you know I love you, but loving you means I can't watch you do this. Time after time, we've had to run because of your behavior and your decisions. We got a son. I got a son. And I love our son enough that I can't have him around while you're like this. I had so many dreams, John. I hoped you would change. We all saw what happened to them that didn't, but you... 
Part of you is hellbent on ending up the same way. And I love you too much to watch that no more. Abigail. Oh, yeah. Abigail left him. I think that's a parcel. Oh, new clothes. Where's the wife, Milton? Uh, she's out. I saw her leaving with the boy and the bags. What's going on? You married Mr. Dickens? No. That don't surprise me. What'd she do? Catch you with a showgirl? I hear about you shooting more fellas over by Strawberry? Just who are you, Jim Milton? I'm a family man. I can handle a gun, sure. Them men shot at me. Just interested, that's all. Ain't nothing interesting. Unless you find gossip about a man's marriage worthy of your time. Guess not. There's work to be done. Unless you're running off too. I ain't going nowhere. I'm here to work. Gotta save money, get her what she wants. What does she want? She wants a place of her own. Said she found a plot up at Beecher's Hope. You? A rancher? You'll starve. Probably. <laughs> Keep yourself busy. Take your mind off it. There's three works. Wonder what these works are. Oh my god, it's far! I'm just curious, can we loot here? Ah, uh, no. Hey, it's a dog! Hello! Hey, cute! Mocha, it's a dog! Mocha! Hey, boy! Mocha! Moka, it's a dog. Cute. <laughs> I miss Kane. I mean, during the gang time or Dutch time, we have a dog in the camp. Kane. His name's Kane. I wonder where's Kane. I think Micah killed him. Honest work, huh? A few months later. But that's her fool. Hey, you know, I was wrong about you. Turned into a fine worker, Jim Milton. Oh, thank you. Means a lot. Hey, you think I could speak with Mr. Geddes? See if maybe he's open to offer me some guidance? No, I'm sure he'd be happy to hear you speak, at least. Thank you, Mr. Dickens. Hey, 
son. How's that bull? Fine, Mr. Milton. Your father in? Can I have a word? Sure. I'll just get him. Pow! Hey, I'm right, right here. <sighs> What's the problem, Milton? Sorry for the disturbance, sir. Oh, no problem. My wife, she just began her morning discourse on the subject of my faults. An experience I think every man can relate to. In some ways, my wife... My wife also has issues with some of the decisions I've made. Real issues. Hmm? Do you believe a man can change, sir? Where is this heading? I guess I don't know. <clears throat> I've tried to be a good hand. I've worked hard to secure your property. And for that, we are grateful. And you've paid me well, besides. The thing is, I suppose, I need to get a place of my own so I can prove to my wife that I've changed. I understand. But I ain't got much money. I ain't asking to borrow none. But maybe you could go to the bank and put in a good word so they could give me a loan. A loan, huh? So I can buy that place, Beecher's Hope? Yes, I know it. Yes, of course, sure. It'd be, it'd be my pleasure. But take my advice, Milton. Take your money and go buy passage on a boat. Go to Brazil and forget all about family. I'm just joking, son. Just make sure you deal with Ansel Atherton at the bank. He's a distant cousin. Here's my name. Tell him to ask me direct himself. He'll get what you need. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I was young and dumb once, too. You'll get her back. He's kind, huh? Mr. Geddes, I mean. The gear, the arsenal. Oh, the old outfit. <laughs> Yeah, the old outfit. Black water. I was told to go. Oh wait, wait, wait! Sorry, guys. I remember something. I need this because I need money. Or wait, wait. Le Sorry, guys. Let me think. I'll just think. One moment. Five. Yeah. We'll sell at. We'll go to fence first to sell. the fuck happened? Fence. How much money do I have? One forty-seven dollars. I'm not used to it. <laughs> I have thousands during Arthur. Remember, hunting gives us money. We could sell it at. We could sell it at the butcher. And I remember this place. We could rob this. If I'm right, if, is this? Is it this house? Is 
This house is nice. You should buy this. It's empty though. It's a nice house though. No one lives here. Ah uh, yeah, we're gonna collect herbs again. I forgot. We're not Arthur anymore. Of course. Horse name is Rachel. Of course it's a girl. Let me just see. H. Fisher for sale. Oh, it's for sale, huh? It's a nice house, though. Sorry guys, it shows controller is low battery, just plugging the charger. Stand up. You're a good girl now. Oh, partner. There's a house, there's a house, guys. Remember. Every loot matters. Oh, this is a, this is the house of uh, we call that Mrs. Dows. Hey, buddy. All right, little fella. Let's pet the dog so he won't bite us. Come on, wag your tail. That's the go signal. All right, we could rob the house. <laughs> Imagine someone. Imagine someone goes to your house. Someone's coming. Don't worry, I'm not gonna loot you. If I loot you, that's minus honor. I'm just gonna rob you. Jesus. 
Hello, sir. I'll take your crackers. You don't mind, right? <laughs> the other guy doesn't care. Easy. Uh, who are you? Taking nothing off me. You be well now. You looking for trouble? No. Hey. Chill out. You're all gonna be tight because of it. Let's go. I hope the dog doesn't bite us. It's raining again. They're the new owner of Dow's Ranch. How much money do we have? One forty seven dollars. Hey, remember this house? Art the uh, just to share guys during Oh, stupid. <laughs> During Arthur's time, Arthur helped build this house. He funded this, guys. Arthur funded this house. Hi, miss. You should... Oh, heavens. Hey, hey, hey. Can you stop that, please? Let off that steam, all right? Uh, well, uh, okay then. I think that's an interaction, but suddenly I rub. So let's try to go away for a little. One moment, guys. We'll go back. All right, that's far enough. We go back. Thing things in front of her. Come on. I'm at the end of my tether. Stop it. I can't get out. Don't mind me. I Thank you, ma'am. That was a good loot. Right here, girl. You're a good filly.
We'll go to fence and then do the main mission. I'm thinking, yeah. We play high honor, guys, for a good ending. I'll play Cyberpunk and then redo RDR2 with low honor. Hey, the blind guy! Can I tell thee? Can I tell thee now? Eternity waits for us all! But which eternity? Help a blind man! Here you go! Embrace those who love you. Not the memory of those who pretended to. All right. Well, I'll have to take your word for it. Are you still here? What are you waiting for? Hey, 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 remember that. Wait, guys, I remember this wagon here. There should be a box here during Arthur's time. Yeah, there, there's a box. If it's still the same, this used to have a rum. Uh, no rum. I'll take this, this is money. Yeah, bourbon. What does a ginseng elixir do? Oh, I get it. So I need this. Wait, guys. It helps us increase our maximum HP, guys. I need this. Of all our... This is Arthur's item, guys. So this is the only good Arthur item that I had. Wait guys, just consuming it for maximum HP. a lot of bottles <laughs> I remember this if you drink the pirate rum Arthur's time though if you drink this too much he'll get drunk and start singing pirate songs let's see if it will happen to John he's getting drunk <laughs> it's hard when you're drunk, guys. He passed out. <laughs> I guess I'll just come first. Wait. If we can come. We don't have money. We have to conserve everything we have. Nice. We can come. Okay. We'll come first.
We'll drink the pirate rum for the experience. Too bad he's not singing. When Arthur was drunk, he's singing, guys. Oh, max level, I see. Alright. Raining again, really? We sleep again, guys. I hate when it's raining because you have to wear a cold outfit, and we're poor for now. We're poor, so we can't we can't risk it. Ah, sunny, nice, nice. gonna sell to fans and do a mission. We'll do the Sadie Adler in Valentine. What the? Are you kidding me? Hey, fucker, you're killing my horse. Okay, new face. I don't trust new faces an inch. It's worth buying. I'll buy it. Pick this up off the street, no doubt. Hmm. Come across a few of these myself. One seventy five. I lost it. If you remember, guys, during Arthur, we have a, a very expensive watch, like the Rolex. Oh, it's here! It's here! One fifty-five dollars. Should I sell it? Hmm. Wait. <laughs> well, we are poor. I've been known to craft little items here and there. You got the coin and the right stuff. I can take a look. New to these parts, mister? How can I help you? Oh, we have dynamite. Okay. And we have the fire bottle. Alright, that's great. 7 out of 8. That's fine. This is what we need. Moonshine. We need supplies, guys. So I'll just buy this.
We might have to sell some more. Yeah. Fuck this, I'll sell everything. As long as it's not crafting, I'll sell it. Ah, it's crafting. Jewelry, sell that. Penelope's bracelet, sell that. Fuck Penelope. Crafting, craft. A gift from Margaret Handler. Yeah, sell that. Good investment! Good thing we didn't sell them during Arthur's time. Oh. Okay. Now we have 400. Not oh, bad. You got something for me? All right. Bye. Have to be a wise spender here, guys. What the fuck? That's a lot. I didn't expect that. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I still have to save some. We'll go to Sadie, guys. Wait, that's a main mission. I just realized. I really need the money, guys. I swear. Sorry. So, I'll just go to the stagecoach mission. John's not really a good guy. I mean, he's not empathetic. As you can see, when I greet he, when I greet the person, he just says, "Sir." Unlike Arthur, hi, Mister. No one here. What the hell are you doing here? I'm sorry. Didn't realize you didn't like visiting. Ah, horse is not good. All right, not worth it. Get out of here now, or I'll make you This is gonna be a long ride guys. We're going to Strawberry and as you know that's very far. I remember this. I remember this. There's a jewelry here during Arthur's time. I'm not sure now if there is. I forgot. Where is it? Ah, yeah, this this box. Cigar. Steven cigar. Yeah, there's a coin. Yep. Twenty-one dollars. Not bad, guys. Not bad. As John, and you know he's he doesn't have money. All coins matter. I saw smoke. Oh, it's far. Never mind. I thought it's near. Now we have to be budget conservative. <laughs> Arthur's time, we make it rain. Long ride, guys. Sorry.
I saw a random encounter. Oh, I remember this guy. in the mood for company right now, partner. All right. You don't strike me as a happy fella. Making my life a misery day and night. All those years chasing her. Well, she didn't want nothing to do with me. Woman problems, right? Might be better you spoke to the lady. You know, you remind me of a feller I talked to years ago. I was slinging these pebbles in too. That's Arthur, guys. Feller told me to be a good man, and the wife come. Bastard ruined my life. <laughs> Listen, partner, I'm hardly one to give marriage advice, but it's better if you stick to it. <sighs> Can't make things worse, I suppose. See you, mister. Then, Come on, lady. she finally says yes. <laughs> what a mistake that was! What I like about John, guys, his satchel is very good. As you can see earlier, I was spending a lot of money on fence and it's still not enough to fill out the bag. So, with John, inventory is not a problem. Money is the problem. Arthur, inventory is the problem. Money is not a problem. So, vice versa. Ah, there's a train again. I hate it when there's a train, it's blocking. We're almost there guys, I remember this place. We're almost there at Strawberry. John, the new Arthur, Alden's friend. I'm another um, discouraged man. Ah, uh, yes. Say no more. I've got something here you might be interested in. So, what are we looking at? This is a big one. Armored bank and coach heading into Strawberry. You'll probably need something to blow the doors. All right. Good seeing you, Hector. Head out to Wanja Banking Coach coming from North Armored Heavy Vehicle with cash left and said, Be careful. We have dynamite, so we can use that to blow up the door. Oh, it's North. Yeah, it's North. I forgot. Hello, ma'am. Hello, sir. Howdy, mister. 
Hey, there's an encounter. I saw it. That's quite a horse you got. Thanks. Oh, the guy is looking for Gavin? Have you seen my dog? I've been looking everywhere for her. She's been gone for hours. Can you help me find her? Please? Sure. I'll keep an eye out. I appreciate it, mister. I surely do. She must be getting real hungry by now. She's a foxhound. You know, white and brown. I if you find her, I live in a house on the edge of town. Thank you, mister. Let's do a little mission, guys. Oh, it's, it's a wide area. Fox sound, white and brown. Miss? Partner, watch where you walk. I am exploding oh, I'm sorry. with joy. And you can too. Literally explode. Because with everything I know, I am literally the happiest man alive. Partner? Hello there. Hi. Many are called, but few are chosen. Blessed are the goats, for they shall be the meek of human kindness. I think. You say so. Oh, I do. I really do. Sorry, guys. Toilet break. One moment. Sorry about that, guys. Hmm. Where's this dog? Doggy, where are you? Oh, 
Oh, I hear the dog. There. Really? John can swim? Are you serious? So Arthur's a better swimmer? <laughs> Gonna get you home. Shit, I lost the stagecoach mission. I just hope it's still available. Oh, I just paid two dollars for that. You, girl. <coughs> Hurry. Hey, can you run? Doggy, can you run? Will she run if I run? Ah yeah, she'll run. Leave me be. Hey, your dog's here. Just walking slow, sorry, but your dog's here. Ah, I still back. All right, I thought I lost it. I will, Mister. Thank you. There, watch out. Hey there. Oh, I got, I got the express bullets. Nice. I just hope I got uh, all of Arthur's weapon. It'd be better if I have the bullets because I have full bullets there. It's my horse. I'll just check, guys, if I have all my weapon. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, yes. I love you. I love you. Ha. Everything right? Yes, everything's here, guys. Everything's here. <laughs> yeah, it's still gold. Yep. All good. I'm so happy, guys. I'm so happy. I'll use my favorite weapon, the one shot, one kill. Change man, come on! Stop fucking with me! We're not rich, guys, sorry, looting. Where's 
the body. There's the last one. I mean, last body guy, sorry. There. Fuck. Horse. What the? I shoot too early. My fault, guys. Right! One more, one more shooting. Or that's it. Yeah, that's it. I just hope there's good money here. Two hundred. Not bad, not bad guys, not bad. By the way, I saw a loot. Maybe I could take it.
We reset strawberry for the meantime, guys. We need to recharge. Or no, no. We'll rest at Valentine since we're, we need to go to Valentine as well. I just realized there's a hole. It's complete there. It's not complete in strawberry. Police are coming. Hey! I did surrender! Are you kidding me? I did surrender! Just saying guys, these horses are useless, you know? Just get get her back later. Stupid horse. This house is still empty, huh? Sorry, horse. I'm not gonna leave you. I love you. But we'll skin them. We'll skin them for meat. We'll sell them.
Can't we? Ah, yeah. We can only cook if we have in skin. I forgot about that. Yeah, I forgot. It's been a long time since I hunt. I forgot. I thought I see something. Sorry guys. Let's go back. I thought I see the Chelonians. The cliff jumpers. We'll get the white horse, I swear. <laughs> Not used to this. She's a fast horse, but when she's carrying something, she's not fast. Unlike the white horse, she's fast whatever you do, you're carrying or not. But I just hope the white horse is still available though. Here, friend, try placing them bullets real careful. One bullet to the vitals worth a hundred any place else. I'll just fix my guns, guys. These guns are very important. Look out, mister. Is it new to the shop? Well, it's really the catalog you want to look at. It's got everything in here. condition keep it up you keep treating that like your own child all right good on you good be no trace of rust on that as far as I can see you keep treating that like your own child all right good on you No trace of rust on that as far as I can see. I'd recommend loading up on extra ammo. Yeah, beautiful condition. Keep it up. Sorry guys, thinking. You keep treating that like your own child, alright? Good on you. Well, it doesn't hurt to stock up on ammo. You never know. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. Yeah, beautiful condition. Keep it up. You 
keep treating Ed like your own child, all right? Good on you. Yeah, beautiful condition. Keep it up. You keep treating Ed like your own child, all right? Good on you. Good? Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. Yeah, beautiful condition. Keep it up. Keep treating Ed like your own child, all right? Good on you. At least we have Arthur's Arthur's weapons. That's what matters, guys. I'll give John a bat. He's been doing farm. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Room's all yours. Head on up. Oh, I just realized. Let's go to the ranch, see if there's horse. I will go to Pearson, bro. <laughs> I know where he is. He's in Rhodes. Would you lack any assistance? Yeah, if, uh, sure, why not? Sit back and relax, hon. You'll leave this place feeling brand new, you know. Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. How's it going with you? Uh, okay? Good, good. God, my wife is amazing. Let's just keep that between us and these four walls, shall we? It kind of makes you forget all the madness outside that door. Well, then. You got a, uh, a real gift for this. Oh, you are too sweet. I feel so skinny without my clothes on. I wouldn't want that for anyone. Yep, I'm finished. It was nice meeting you. I think I figure out something, guys. I'll just check it here when I sleep. One moment. Can I help you with anything? I think I figure out something, guys. I'll, just check I'll disclose what I figure out when I confirm it. One moment. Yes! <laughs> the outfits are here. So meaning I still have the... If please be here. Please be here. I'm begging you. Yeah! <laughs> happy. Happy guy. Found it, guys. See? Outfit on horse. So the cowboy. This will be my... No, 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 no. This will be my... Wait, wait. Thinking. I would say this will be my crime outfit. Where's the winter? The winter one for cold. You'll be on the horse. So... Custom outfit. So we have to custom another one.
winter costume. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what to do. Alright. Bear with me, guys. Bear with me. Ah, this one, yeah. Is this my vest? I forgot. Ah, yeah, that's my vest. Yeah, that's my vest. Good thing I can still have Arthur's clothes. I thought I lost them forever. Sorry guys, bear with me, okay? Thinking. Forgot my pirate boots. I forgot how to make this long sleeve. We can make this long sleeve. I just forgot. How do we make this long sleeve again? I forgot. How do we make this long sleeve again? Modify! Yeah, I remember. Modify. There! Yeah, this is not the shirt. I remember. This is not the shirt. Second thought. Wait. Hmm. Oh yeah, we have bandana that time during Arthur. Yeah, I remember. Sorry guys, just bear with me, okay? I. Oh. 
uh, there's something lacking. I just forgot. boots this is a different boots i remember the color this one yeah this is the boots yeah this is the boots i remember So we have winter outfit and the normal outfit. This is this will be my crime outfit, the cowboy. Oh, it feel it feels good to be back. I got it, bro. <laughs> no, bro, I don't have the Arthur's gold. So sad. That's the only thing left. Mauser pistol, yeah, they're in my M198. I'll take that. Shit, I forgot. What's that shotgun again? I think that's it. All we need is sleep. We got the outfit. I'm so happy I got the outfit again. I thought I... I'll be honest, guys. I'll be honest. I thought... I feel sad. I thought I lost the pirate hat. <laughs> I really love this thing, you know? So, what I figure out is, maybe, since I, I recovered the guns, uh, what I figure out is maybe I can recover the equipment by go by going to the locker. And I was right. I've recovered it. Hmm. This doesn't look like the right vest. One moment, guys. I remember the vest to be... This doesn't look like the right one. One moment, guys, okay? Is the best. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah, I think this is the best. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind the best. Let's just go. I'm just happy I got this back. Hey, John, maybe you can get Arthur's gold. That'd be great. Oh, 
It's fixed. Remember, guys, this is still in construction during Arthur's time. Morning. Excuse me, ma'am. Is this open? Oh, it's not open. Morning, miss. You might want to think about a fresh set of clothes. Relax. I ain't causing trouble. Thank you. Ah. Yeah, we need to uh, one last thing. Please, please be here. Okay. Let me just see if I can get Arthur's horse. One last thing, guys, before I do the main mission. Please be here, please be here. I'm begging you, please be here. Hello there. Is that horse doing all right? If you want me to keep that overnight, there's... Ah, no. <laughs> horse is empty. Well, we'll hunt horse later, but I'm so happy I got the outfit back. That's what matters. I just want to check something, guys. Wait. Winter gunslinger for the cold, the cowboy for the crime, custom outfit, this one. This is for the crime and custom outfit. Yeah, all right. And there's one more thing missing. I see. Wait, guys. I'll just go back to the cabinet. There's one more thing missing. I can't live without that. If you remember guys, the Jason mask. It's missing. What do you call that? Bandana, I believe? Masks. Yeah, mask. I'll save this on the horse. Yeah. Save this on the horse. Is it, is it, ah, this is the Jason, yeah. Save this. Look like Chainsaw Massacre. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. All good. We're all good. We just need money, but we're all good. We just have to build up some muscles as well because Arthur's bulky. John is a little bit skinny. Thanks for your time. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. I forgot. I'll just buy horse food because I I'll be needing that. I'll be needing a lot of that. Sorry guys, one moment. We'll do the mission. I'll just uh, prepare things. What the fuck? I can carry 99 pieces of apple, that's why. Uh -huh. I'll just take 10. It's all yours. He is important. Sorry guys, we have to stock up on that. Too much money, too much money. If I have Arthur's money, that's easy. Piece of sh piece of 
Oh, YouTube Protocol. Piece of, piece of amazing. Fuck! I just take a bat. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? I just took a bat. Never mind. I thought I told you to leave it, Bubba. And I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she's telling anything to? Uh, enjoy your drink in peace. <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right now. What that mean? For the last time. Leave me alone. Or what? <laughs> what a tough girl. She kills us all. You, you, get out of here. <laughs> Dirty John. <laughs> On Marston. It is good to see you. <laughs> I thought I heard a rumor you was alive. Jim Milton, that you? Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed a feller up by Roanoke? Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She... She's fine. <laughs> she was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy some property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and some other stuff. Good and bad. Yes, bro. And me, eh. Nalaglag sa kabay. My bounty pa pala ako. I have to pay the bounty. Maybe. Come on then. Too dirty, bro. Strawberry. Got on the run from New York. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No. With a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. Come on. We got a bit of a ride. I know. We'll check later, guys, if it's available. The white horse, I mean. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. I think I'm wanted in strawberry, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I'm wanted in strawberry. Fifty cents. What? Micah. Micah? I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Now we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I aim to be. Probably why I can't afford it. <laughs> this country's becoming real civilized. Bad folk won't be around for long. Who's this? Wait, guys. Someone messaged me on Messenger. Ah, uh, it's my friend. What's it need? While I'm here, I'll pay the bounty. Excuse me, friend. I'm looking for a Nathan Kirk, fellow from New York. Got any mail for him? Kirk? Kirk? No. Not so as I would remember. Curly, I think. Oh, she's a woman. <laughs> Ask in the welcome center. Most tourists check in there. Okay, thank you. Anyway, can I pay my bounty with you, please? Please! Hey! Ah! I assume you'll say something if you're happy.
Good. You seen a fella? A fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, s s sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. <laughs> I feel the sarcasm. Arthur time, I remember there's a loot here. Since we have a lot of our backpacks very full. There! We could carry a lot. So imagine that guy's 99 per item. <laughs> Arthur's time, our maximum is 5 per item. But we have money though. <laughs> I mean, Arthur's time, we have money. Mr. Kirk! Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. Loot, loot. Just a friend. Come on, open the door. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. Open the goddamn door. Wait, guys, look. Remember, we're poor. <laughs> I'll save my money for the bullets. So some gun oil. Hey bro, when you came back, let's eat ramen. You sa ko bro? Sarap yun. Yung tiluro ko siya. There's money! Money, money, money! La na, la na, la na. Alright, let's kick the door. So I'll use my rope. He's wanted alive, so I'll use my rope. Stay on him. I'll catch up with you. Where are you going? Shit. Stupid. There we go. Oh, this is the logging area! Come on, Kirk. Don't make this hard. Come on, Kirk. Don't make this hard. Horse stamina is depleting. That's the downside of this horse. Damn horse! 
right there. Get off me! I'm the the bastard. I don't deserve this treatment. Will I lose honor? I'm risking it. Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. No, nice. Not Real losing honor. I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My wife, my wife is a, is a desperate woman. How, how are you buried, sir? None of your business what I am. She made me do it. She... Uh, what now? Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Hold on to it for me. Need to speak to the bank over in Blackwater. Get a loan for the property. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. So I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm usually at the saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so I'll come find you. I badly needed a... Hey, what's that? Bounty poster. I need to pay my bounty, guys. It's hard when you're wanted. One moment, I'll just... I need a... What do you call that again? Post office! Yeah, post office. Bounty as John is just slow, guys. 50 cents. Arthur's time, it's already $5. Maybe because they're adjusting it. They know John is poor. Being John, guys, I'll be honest, it's hard to earn money. start over. Thanks, mister. Come on, lady. I remember one of Arthur's friend. Speaking of the post office, let's go to Valentine post office. Let me see if I could find him. Stop! What the fuck? Are you kidding me? So, here's my plan guys, I'll check Arthur's friend at post office in Valentine and then I'll see if I can still find the, what do you call that, the white horse. I'm not sure if there's another one that will respawn. Wait, preparing my guns just in case a fight in... Ah, yeah. We're fully equipped. Shit, minus honor. Uh oh. I mean, I'm playing high honor. I lost two honor for one, really.
Herbs, guys, herbs. One moment. If I'm not mistaken, I think this is the poison plant. Let me eat this one. Oh, Let's go, we got, it says we got used because we Arthur times if you eat that you'll get poison <laughs> Sorry guys Or is a spurn There might be something here. Just wanna check, guys. Real quick. There might be something here. It says inspect site. There, there. I'll be honest, guys. Arthur's better at drawing. John's not good at drawing. Anyway, let's go to the goal. Arthur's friend, and then try to see if the white horse is still available. Ah, uh, we're in Valentine. I know it already. So, we'll see... We'll go... I'll mark it to get the white horse. But I forgot where the white horse is. Yeah! This one, this one. Horse is here. Right? Wait, I forgot! Wait, guys, wait, I forgot. There's a landmark I remember... Is it Paro Lagoon? No, no, no. I'm sure, I'm sure. This time, I'm sure. Yeah. Lake Isabella. It should be here. Wait! Shit! No, no! Wait, wait. It's not. It's the freezing parts. Planter... I think it's here? Shit, I forgot. I guess I'll check it later. <laughs> I forgot. Really, I forgot. Other friends not here. Should be here. No one's here, so maybe I could rob the horses. Please don't kick me. Please don't kick me. Nice, 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 nice. Don't kick me, eh? Don't kick me. Please, don't kick me, don't kick me. Don't kick. Nice. Don't kick, don't kick. No kicking. No kicking. Ah! He kicked me. He got panic, so it's automatic. He'll kick me again if I do it. So that's fine. We got a, at least we got a loot. 
I'll just do this bounty, guys, because I need money. Badly, guys, as John, I need money. I guess we have to find a better horse. I think it's a long ride. Long ride to strawberry. I just realized this is not strawberry, this is Saint Denis where we're going. I remember this place, Arthur time. This is a logging area. Wonder if there's loot here left? None. Things have changed, huh? I mean, in the game, things have changed. This horse is not tough, honestly guys. <laughs> the white horse is tougher. dollars Mark Cavanaugh. He's one of them boys down from Laramie. 
They say they businessmen chasing up land deals. But I know hired guns when I see them. Laramie? I'm acquainted with some of those fellas. Yeah, Mayor's got a strange tolerance. But this one's gone too far. He's up north of here, the other side of the mountain. Tell me about this bounty. What's his charge? Intimidation, the destruction of property, violent assault. But they're all things we turn a blind eye to now if you're from those parts, or so I'm instructed. Okay. Why are we after this fella then? Poor Kavanaugh got fresh with the wrong girl. The cattleman's daughter. He's what you'd call an example to the rest. Indeed. I guess I know my job then. We ain't fussing, bring him back dead or alive. Dead or alive. I'll bring him alive. That's high honor. Okay. Wait guys, I saw a random encounter in the map. This guy again? Mister? This mad preacher again. Go, Rachel. Yeah, I remember this house. Maybe we could enter this as John? Because as Arthur, it's always closed. I'm just curious, guys. Wait. Curiosity strike, something like that. Ah, uh, it's still closed. I wonder how, do we, how we can open this. Close?
Oh yeah, I realized something. Maybe Dutch money is still in there. We'll go back to the previous camp, Beaver Hollow. We'll do the bounty first. You're dead. I mean, you're wanted dead or alive, right? Oh, that's him? Well, never mind. Alright, looting guys, not rich, you know. There's a card. I know it. Is it a card? Oh, I think no. It's my imagination, I guess. Hey, calm down, horses. Because I'll loot you. Don't kick. a racehorse no I don't like racehorse they're not tough oh we almost died stop looting <laughs> stop looting horses we almost die
Ah, remember that. Just the cemetery. Sheriff. Jack Cavanaugh. It is. He ain't waking up, neither. All right. Put him down around the side of the building. I'll get your pay. Did I loot it? I forgot. Oh, yeah. I did loot it. these boys from Laramie. Don't I know it. That's fine. Won't be any more bounty posters up on this wall. Makes the visitors nervous, I'm told. What's the name of the sheriff? Farley. I guess that's it for now guys it's 5 a.m. I have to sleep so I'll be seeing you tomorrow guys again same time thank you for watching have a great day okay bye for now everyone thanks for watching appreciate it make sure to click the like and subscribe button bye for now